Yo, what is good boys and welcome back to another video. Today we're going over my favorite running backs in Madden. Let's hop in to number 10 right now. All right, boys, kicking it off at number 10, I have the 97 team of the year, Jameer Gibbs. 97 speed, 96 excel, 98 agility, a very, very good elusive receiving back. But when I look at running backs, there are three things that I look at to make sure, like, who, when I was comparing these guys, it's their stats. Jameer Gibbs top, top was a lot of them on stats. But then I also look at their size, 5'9", 199 isn't the biggest. That's actually really small. And then I look at their abilities, and Jameer Gibbs' abilities are not crazy. Nothing for free. And the only thing I would even consider running on him on my squad would be evasive for one. But even then, like, the juke, the juking in this game is already, you know, it's pretty good. So you wouldn't, like, it's like forcing yourself to have to use an ability. But with that all said, Jameer Gibbs is the 10th best running back in the game, in my opinion. At number nine, I have the 12th Christian McCaffrey card we've gotten this year. I'm using the NFL honors, but you can also use the team of the year. Both play very similar. The only reason this card is above Jameer Gibbs, in my opinion, he's a little bit slower, but he is heavier and he does get a free ability. Boys, we know that this game right now is currently all ability based. The best cards are the cards that gets the best abilities and you'll tell by my number one selection. Zero AP jukebox is literally all it takes to be one place ahead of Jameer Gibbs even though the speed isn't fully there, but I have CMC at nine. Also, I didn't mention this earlier, but the market is absolutely destroyed. If you're looking to upgrade your team, go upgrade it right now. I haven't been home for a few days, so I haven't been able to fully record and like, realize what has happened to this EA market. But a lot of these cards are sitting at their lowest value unless EA does something with the market, gets through these price caps. That's a video for another time though. Let's not touch that. But Josh Jacobs is my eighth best running back in the game. He gets a little bit of everything, in my opinion, except the abilities, which we can look at after. 97 speed, 5'10", 220, much bigger back than the first two. And ability-wise, the free agency cards kind of got kind of got tanked a little bit by their abilities. I don't think they got anything too good in general. And I mean, yeah, same thing McCaffrey got for free, and you can put tank on for 1 AP if you like that. Overall, though, Josh Jacobs, I think, slides in perfectly at number eight. All right, boys, so in Madden, size matters. Didn't mean it like that. But um, Derrick Henry is one of the heavier backs in the game at 255 pounds. I don't have this card maxed out right now, but this is just at his 96 overall. 96 speed, 95 excel. I think Derrick Henry is might be the heaviest back in the game. I'll have to double check that. But like I just said, size is, size is huge. The bigger, the better. The bigger, the better. Um, ability wise, a maxed out Henry, I don't even know what he gets, but simply I'm sliding him in here because it's a beefy boy. You guys have all seen Derrick Henry play football. I don't need to explain why Derrick Henry is a tank, but in my opinion, size kind of outplays stats a little bit. And I think Derrick Henry, for a free card you get from just playing this season, perfect slot at number seven. Unfortunately for us though, no more free options on this list. I'm sorry, fellas. But at number six, I have Marshall Falk, who is basically a buy it now at 260,000 coins. Jeez, this auction house is just destroyed. 97 speed, decent size at 510 to 11. And it's really the abilities. He gets the AKA Cruise Evasive X Factor. And boys, I'm going to say this right now. Anything that is lit up the entire game, you need to have on your field. They're absolutely just disgusting. Um, the Marshall Falk gets that for 260,000 coins. What more can you ask for? The rest of his abilities though, Energizer, Human Joystick, and Short and Elite for one in the sixth, and then the same thing in the fifth. So you can literally run a free Energizer and Human Joystick, not touching the rest of your team with Marshall Falk. Sixth best running back, I think. I think he slides in perfectly right there. My fifth pick is definitely a homer pick because I love the Bijan Luster card. And it's Bijan Robinson's Nike athlete, whatever promo this is. Um, 97 speed, 97 excel, basically 99. So 97 plus is all around the board. 81 catch is pretty, pretty good. I think Bijan deserves a little bit more. I don't think EA watches football. Um, 5'11, 220, again, a bigger back, but he's no Derrick Henry. And they really did my boy dirty with abilities. Like I said, this is kind of a homer pick. Personally, if you're looking to pick up between him or Marshall Folk, uh, I'd probably go Marshall Folk. But I love Bijan cards. I love how they play. I love how they run. I am just absolutely meat riding Bijan Robinson right now. He had a really good bracket. This guy is so cool. 
Uh, I'm kidding. But B. John Robinson is a top five-ish running back in the game. And if you haven't tried him out, definitely worth it because you need to collect all the Nike, EA, Nike cards to begin with. So you might as well give him a shot. Number four might be bolder, and that's Emmett Smith. I've actually personally used this card, and that is the whole reason why he is number four above Folk and Bijan. This card is gross. Screw the speed. He's 210. He's a big back. Bigger than Marshall Folk. And he gets the evasive, aka Cruz, or the angry runs, aka Cruz. This is what you pick up this card for. This is why Madden is broken. Thanks, EA. This is why a 96 overall running back with 96 speed is the fourth best running back in your game. It's all abilities. Energizer for zero two, so just keep his keep him re replenished. And then uh, you literally just need to run angry runs in Energizer, and you will run the ball all over these fools in the game. So Emmett Smith, number four. The other thing that I said in the beginning was stats do matter, and that is the case here with Raheem Mostert, Sugar Rush, 99 speed. He has to be top three. He's the only card, only running back in the game with base 99 speed. Not the only card in the game, only running back in the game with base 99 speed. And I mean, sue me. 99 speed, gotta be top three. I don't even care what abilities he gets. I know he's got some stuff that is decent, yeah decent abilities matchup nightmare he's, he's your typical elusive receiving back in this game if you're in a hot route master quarterback and for whatever reason you don't want to use the number one running back on this list which at this point i don't know what we're doing but 99 speed base raheem moster is a very solid option and number two it's the only gold 99 running back in the game i mean what more could you ask for except he's not one because number one if you haven't guessed by right now i am the biggest bo jackson meat rider like <sighs> kidding um 99 gold, gold 99 kiki barber saquon barkley beefer on twitter 98 speed 99 excel i mean he looks like a gold 99 i mean i don't have to sit here and explain to you guys Zero AP jukebox, zero AP grab and go back to the master for one. And then, so yeah, I mean, this card is a very, very good running back. But if you look at these X factors, you don't see angry runs X factor anywhere. So how can you be number one? Because Bo freaking Jackson has been in this game for over a month and a half. And I am not taking him out of my lineup until either AKA angry runs, whatever is significantly more AP or... They drop another angry runs running back. So let's go talk about Bo and get off Tiki Barber. For 225 whole Madden coins, you can get the greatest running back to ever to ever exist in the face of this game. I get Eric Dickerson flashbacks every single time I see this dude on the field. And every single time I see this dude on my field, I feel like I feel, I feel like I'm him. I, I mean I am. You can't stop him. I feel like everyone who is watching this video understands how freakishly good this card is. Three things for me that matter about running backs. Stats, 98 speed, size, 6'1", 227, and abilities. Angry runs, NFL combine, charges up nine plays, and then basically you can run two clock the entire game. For 225,000 coins, if you don't have this card yet, what are you doing? Either uninstall Madden because you're an idiot, or go pick up Bo Jackson and thank me later. Maybe subscribe. Yeah, Bo Jackson, number one running back in the game, and won't, and this won't change until we see either Angry Runs is removed, increased, or we get a better Angry Runs running back. And with that said, boys, thank you so much for watching this video. I have to go to class right now. Got to make sure I go study and call my parents. I will catch you fellas in tomorrow's video. Peace.